Come on, Rob, start us off. Welcome everyone to Vancouver. Oh yes, fabulous Vancouver. We're here in Canada, which we love. Getting it's ready for the big. Warmer than the United States. My dad told me it's minus 21 in Illinois. Wow. All right, we're in Vancouver. Everybody's getting ready for the big opening of the end of the road tour tomorrow. Guys, are getting ready? Hey, somebody let me know how the internet is. Is it coming in clear? Because I don't know how the signal is here. I'm gonna try to stay out of everybody's way. You guys can get a little sense of how massive the stage is. We're not obviously showing anything that you're just seeing pieces of the puzzle here. A massive KISS crew this year. Probably more people than ever been on a KISS crew. And everybody's working. <laughs> at Rogers Arena in Vancouver. First time the stage is being set up at this venue. How you doing? Facebook Live right now. <laughs> We're gonna see you on the whole tour. Or you just local? Like Howard Stern, I didn't see that one coming. Might be because I'm a little tired today. I'm excited. I did not sleep much getting ready for this. I'm not really sure how these guys know what's going on. There are so many moving pieces and parts and cables. These guys are amazing. They work so hard. They loaded in today at 3 a.m. A lot of these guys have been working nonstop since then, and they're nowhere near done. This thing is probably going to take until, I'm guessing, close to 5 or 6 p.m. today. We're treating it like it's a show day, like this is a no normal load-in like Kiss would be playing tonight. So this is their first run-through as it being a real show. This is definitely the most moving parts and the biggest that KISS has ever had. Not so much just on the stage itself, but what we call the stage is everything that encompasses it. Everything above it, everything on the sides. The stage itself is actually pretty, pretty plain as far as uh, very open. Nothing is going to block anyone's view anywhere. Um, here is the stage itself. <laughs> Guys, you're on. Whether you want to be or not. <laughs> Kiss Facebook. How you doing, man? Good morning. Glad you. Good. Love the shirt. Thank you. You're on Kiss Facebook. Yeah. Bye. <laughs> Now you're really seeing the crew at work. You have four guys working hard just to get a small piece of the stage going. You see all the cables above. This is just a massive production. I think everyone's going to really enjoy this. It's really amazing. There's just so much stuff in the air, so many moving parts. The lights. 
it's probably the best light show they've ever had. Um, lots of the lights are incorporated into different moving screens, and uh, it's, it's kind of hard to describe. There's just miles of cable everywhere. I don't know how these guys do this. And then how they're going to tear it down after the show and drive to the next city and get it set up again. Just See, we're going to meet a lot of people on this tour, especially when we start knowing a lot more of these guys. Michael! Here is Gene's, Gene's Tech Michael from our Facebook Live. How's giving them a little preview of, since they can't tell what the stage looks like. We can show it. What do you think of the new stage? Oh, it's bombastic. It's amazing. I love it. Good time. You excited for the tour? Oh, yeah. It's going to be yeah. great. We're going to have a good time, huh? Yeah. Well, Very thank excited. you. I'll be bothering Michael every day, pretty much. So you'll be seeing him, a lot of them. <laughs> You guys doing? I really don't know how they know what to do in all this chaos, but it's amazing they do. They do a great job, these guys and girls. Hanging cables above us right now. Anybody who's doing the ultimate VIP package, when the stage is set up, or tomorrow when I film, when I show you where the seats are, people are going to be amazed. They are, you are literally touching the stage. It, it, it's it's a far beyond what I expected. Uh, you are literally on the corner of each stage, and it's really, it's the closest that I've ever seen anyone get for a show. It's special, the production team built the special pod area for on one on Gene's side and one on Paul's side for the ultimate package. I mean, we know it's an expensive package, but the tour is going to be amazing. The seats are amazing. And uh, you can't get any closer to KISS than, than where you'll be standing. And I'll, I'll make sure to film that tomorrow and show everybody. Give you some little more snippets here. Just see some lights working. What's up, Rudy? How are you? Let's go over into the bathroom. Let's all down, Marco, to keep an eye on my guys real quick. You guys can get a sense of how, how massive this is and how many different pieces of the stage there is. I love it. You get these people on here making detrimental comments to Kiss. Why are you on, why are you on our page? Get the hell off. We love Kiss here. Everyone? Hi, Mark. Rudder, you said? Sorry, guys. Yes. Yeah. Trying to stay out of the way. Hey. How are you? We'll do a big reveal tomorrow, obviously, live. The band doesn't want to show too much of it put together. They want everyone to be surprised the first night. And uh, oh, we will definitely do some Facebook Live tomorrow. It looks like the internet's halfway decent in here. And uh, hopefully we can get some good stuff. Hey, man. Hi. You want to say hi? You're on Kiss Facebook. <laughs> she was a little shy. Hi. A lot of local crew helping. I think I hear Steve Roman, our stage manager. Hey, Steve! 
Let's see if we can bother them. They love to be bothered while they're setting up. It's their favorite thing when they see me coming with the camera. In this chaos, you have a moment? What's going on? Steve Roman, our stage manager. <laughs> so, obviously we're showing some of this because people can't tell what it is yet. How long does this take from the time you guys started today till you, when you think it's done? Oh, I'll probably be here until 4 o'clock until we're done. So, we, you guys started, what, at 3.30, 4 o'clock? Some, started, some started, carpenters came in at 3? at 4.30. We started yeah. chalking at 4.30. Hey, we don't do it all. Um, and a lot of, lot of local crew too, or? Oh yeah, 100, 120. And then our, our crew's what, about 80? 80. Biggest, biggest KISS production you've biggest been involved in? Yeah, been, yeah, yeah, same thing. Well good, we'll be bothering Steve every <laughs> night on the entire tour. Thanks Steve, we'll see you in a little bit. We'll film this in other cities and I'll grab it on Good content so we can post it on YouTube or something but I just thought you guys would like to see this today it's the first load and everybody's really excited um, band doesn't come in until tomorrow they did all production rehearsals and and went back to LA oh we go over and see some stuff over here this is Eric's new tech yep. you're on Facebook live whether you like to be or not, I'll be bothering you the entire tour. <laughs> and Michael likes to be on, so we'll see him a lot. Well, kind of do. All right. Well, we won't bother you as much as we bother everyone else. You'll get in the kiss camp. You switching? Out. Eric picked the clear ones. He said. So these are changing. They've decided to take these from. Uh, the chrome, Paul Stanley and Eric talked about it. They think they reflect too much, so that's what Gump's working on. We're gonna switch them out to to uh, clear, I think Eric said now. But yeah, you get a little sense of his kid here. See everybody? Non-stop, so have more trailer trucks for this tour than any KISS tour. More buses. Everybody getting getting ready. We'll do a little walk through the hallway real quick. Nothing's really happening yet. The wardrobe girls. I've started bringing everything in, getting everything set up. Get the band, Michael. <laughs> right here. What do you got? Are oh, this jeans? Let's see what else we got. Hopefully the internet's okay coming in here. His video screens where the video director will direct everything for the video screens, I mean. Um, again, it's just, just amazing how many cables and non-stop I'm gonna to try to do something different on this tour I want to try to meet everyone introduce everyone who's involved in the tour find out what their job is well the next few nights here's a laundry today as you can see right now it's yeah, only for kiss wardrobe cleaning everything get your rules and regulations this is the first tour that I've been on where I actually travel on the bus and we'll actually be doing laundry at the venue, that should be fun. Are you, man? <laughs> Thank you. We'll see, I saw a little surprise over here earlier, which was very cool. We have a, uh... oh, here's our catering. We're gonna be traveling with us for Facebook Live. <laughs> we'll be seeing everybody a lot. <laughs> You're live. I'm waving at you to <laughs> wave back. <laughs> And kiss Facebook. We'll be bothering you the whole tour. They do, uh, their food's very good, so they take good care of us. Ready? They do three meals a day, obviously, breakfast, lunch, and dinner. They have different time schedules. I'll show some schedules later on. Oh, yeah, this is yeah. Good? You're, you're going to be famous. Well, you're probably. <laughs> 
Here we go. More cables. It was the, uh, the surprise I was talking about right here. Kind of exciting. We're going to all get the place and kiss pinball. Classic machine. Road. Right next to the Vancouver Canucks Hockey Club. As you can see, cases. This is normal. There's uh, actually more than usual just because so many different things happening. Oh, here's Melissa. Melissa is Paul Stanley's assistant with wardrobe on this tour. She's moved over to camp, to Team Paul Stanley. Can't, Stanley. can't go wrong with that. <laughs> and here's Paul's room. We're still getting ready. Getting, getting set? Getting set. Getting ready for the big man to come in. Everybody's happy. There you go. Guys, see some stuff. There it is. New costumes. Hi, how are you? I love these signs. I see them every day, but it's still cool. Still cool. This is probably, I haven't been down this hallway yet. I don't know how the internet's going to go when I go into some of these sections, but um, probably another dressing room it's going to be, or a series of dressing rooms, shower as well. Some stuff not set up. The band's not coming in until tomorrow, so some of the stuff's still being done. A lot of excitement here, though. A lot of people from out of town, all over the world flying in, a lot of friends, family. And, uh, it's gonna be a, it's gonna be pretty exciting tomorrow. It's the first the first show of the end of the road. There we go, Doc's office. I don't think Doc's in yet. I think Doc's still in LA. Hi, how are you? <laughs> Here, kiss face, Facebook. <laughs> and then oh, here's catering. Hi, how are you? It's where everybody eats. Sorry, man. Sorry. Just doing the uh, the glance through. Hey, Casey. Yeah, yeah. You wanted some airtime? Come on. <laughs> what time did you get in today? 6 a.m. What time do you think on a normal show day? You come in at 6 a.m.? And then what time do you think by the time you tear down at the end of the night? Oh, shit. It'll be 2 in the morning. I will be done at 2 in the morning. If all goes well. Day. There were and then you move to the next city and you get up... <laughs> We'll see you later, man. You'll be meeting all these people. Casey's a big part of the carpenter team and stage production. I haven't been down this end, so. Oh, here's our production office. Matt Barley. Hey, come on, you gotta get in here too. Just filming Facebook Live. Kiss. Hi. <laughs> We're gonna meet everybody in the crew. Ryan and Chad, we're live on KISS Facebook. Yeah! <laughs> Matt, what are you doing on this tour? I'm just Pyro? helping out with pre-production. For? Pyro? Uh, for, for anything. Come on, so all the people out there know you're responsible for this, right? Nope. Come on, come on, nope. come on. Nope, 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 nope. <laughs> nope. I will say I've seen the Pyro. It's amazing, so he should take credit for it. But no. What about Ryan? Hello, Sergeant. I need you to come in here and remove Keith Lerner from the <laughs> office. You've been trying to do that for 20 years busy. now. We're very busy. <laughs> Hi, Chad. Keith LaRue, welcome. Tour? Thank Tour accountant, right? No. What do you do? Come on. Uh, all the money. <laughs> well, that's, that's good. All the money. <laughs> so the most important person on the tour. Ryan, head of security. Make what security else? Director? Ticketing? Ticketing? Absolutely. Don't ask me for tickets, though. It's not possible. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's a no-comp tour. I let everybody know. We've got so the sorry. word out there. So sorry. Content? Hi. Are you here for the first few shows? Came up with the first show. First. You excited? Yeah. Is it where you want it to yeah. be? I think so. That's exciting. I'm excited. I've seen it. I'm excited. <laughs> oh, look who's over here. One that takes good care of me all the time with all my complaints and changes to my travel schedule and hotels and everything. <laughs> Ashley, you do everything, right? You want everything to do with moving the tour? And a little bit of everything. Cool. A little bit of everything. So, try and keep everybody on track. 
We're just doing a, a general hello today. We're going to bother everyone on the whole tour. Perfect. Meet everybody. Thank you. Right. Goodbye, Ryan. I need some passes, by the way. Goodbye, no. <laughs> we'll definitely introduce you to these people a little bit more. Oh, Andy Wardrobe also. Andy, see her later. She works mostly with Eric, but she helps everybody. And here it is. I'm sure everybody knows this. Still being used. This is the dressing room for, it'll be Tommy Jean and Eric. Oh, Dave Matthews. I know he doesn't like his screen time, but he's getting a little bit. Facebook. <laughs> Say hello, Dave. Come on. Very important part. <laughs> and here's, here's where it all happens. I'll come back to bother you in a minute. Sure, let's catch up. So there you go. You see Paul's room, the rest of the guy's room, and uh, that's about it for now. I'll, uh, I'll try to get some more. You know, we, we're not going to, like I said, we're not going to reveal too much of the stage. We want it to be a big surprise. So probably tomorrow we'll, uh, we'll definitely do it live when it goes live. And, uh, and we'll, be doing these, we'll be doing these reports a lot on this tour. We'll be doing some from the bus and from the crew and the band and everything until everybody gets tired of it and won't allow me to do it anymore. You see, we'll walk through the venue one more time so you guys can see it. Anything we haven't seen you guys want to see besides the stage put together. How are you, man? One thing about this is everybody's really friendly. It's a real family attitude. Everybody's excited. Everyone likes, even though they're long hours and they work really hard, these guys, they've, they're, always, they're always excited about getting it done, getting the stage together. And, and how you guys doing, man? Tomorrow before the... Uh, the show when when the cases are out and the the guitars and everything are open I'll, I'll go through each guitar and we'll show as much as we can and then obviously the next couple of days after the tour starts and you guys have seen the stage we'll get a closer look and go through different things and, uh, but it just keeps coming they've got they've been here literally and you know Steve the trucks loading in starting at six and they're still bringing trucks in they're still Unloading, so you can tell how much more is coming into the venue. Um, just starting to this look like stage left. This looks like some guitars and these cases, and then you know Fran and the other techs' work areas will be set up obviously after this is done. Can do one more walk through, see what you guys are doing. And kiss Facebook. <laughs> How do you know what you're doing? Running a uh, change up as we go. <laughs> I don't know how you guys know every day. It's amazing. I'm impressed every day. And, and this stage is so intricate and so much stuff, it's even more impressive than the normal stages that these guys can put this together and tear it down in a, in a fashion that they can get to the next city with driving time and reset it up again. It's, I, it's really amazing. It's going to be uh, Robert Long, the production manager, told me today, tomorrow, big test, obviously. There's three back-to-back -back shows to open the tour with a brand-new stage. And uh, he said it's going to be interesting, you know, because they're really going to have to really move. Well, there you go. Hope you guys like this. Like I said, we're going to keep doing a lot of this stuff. And, um, and I hope everybody's excited out there as we are here. It's going to be a uh, it's going to be an incredible run. The band is tighter than they've ever played. The production rehearsals were amazing. Everybody was commenting on it. the energy of the guys, how excited they are. They're all in good shape. Uh, a lot of surprises. Eric Singer's got a nice big moment during the show that I think you guys are all going to have fun with. 
um, Tommy's, Tommy's, um, during Shock Me, uh, it, I, I don't want to give too much away, but it's really cool, just the, the effects he's doing, things tied into with his guitar and the video screens, and, and, um, and just the look of the stage and what happens when Tommy's doing Shock Me is really cool. It's one of my favorite parts, actually. Uh, Gene flying in a, in a little different way, and, and yeah, I think you guys are going to be excited. It's really exciting for me. I've been seeing this stuff for the last couple of weeks, and it's going to be a lot of fun to share it with everybody tomorrow and to have people, you know, a lot of my friends are coming in, too, to have them witness it. And then we'd love to hear from all you guys, too, when you first see it, especially in person. I don't think YouTube and Facebook Live are going to do it justice. It really is... Uh, it's really cool to see it. And it's something where you can sit up front and be right in your face, or you could be in the last row of the venue and you'll have a totally different perspective of it. It's just so wide. It literally parts of some of the parts, um, I don't even know how to describe it, go off to the left and right sides of the venue, you know, further into the, into the seating area than I've ever seen Kiss. And there's some pyro on them and there's lasers and different things. So you guys aren't seeing anything right now. Um, I don't know, some of the little under the stage. Obviously, they build as much of it here. When the lighting people are done, they'll move this stage. Obviously, it's on wheels. They move it into position. Then they start adding, obviously, you know, the drum riser and kits and microphones and all the onstage stuff is last. All right, guys. We'll check in later. Hope you enjoyed this. Talk to you soon.